Okay, so here's a comment, one of many from the bat that have been put on my YouTube and then withdrawn. Luckily, I've got emails of them. Here's one, and this is the one that I've reported to the police. Uploading videos has its drawbacks. I will explain bum. Every video you upload will leave a signature trace, your personal IP address. I now have the relevant information, with a question mark. Normally I'd say that trolling is very childish, and not something I'd do. But given the bizarre wording of this particular troll's comments, I have decided that this is a threat against me, my person, my identity, my identity in cyberspace, me in cyberspace, and my personal liberty. Therefore, this matter is now with the police. I'm warning the bat to stay well away. He's tried to put various different comments using different user IDs onto my YouTube channel. If anything happens to me, my person, my family, my belongings, my property, oddly enough my family are Jehovah's Witnesses, if anything happens to my internet, if I am hacked, you will be directly responsible for this. You may think that the police are not interested. The officer that I spoke to today assures me that because of the mentally diseased apostate watchtower that was released and reported to the police that they have a crime number that I can use if I feel threatened by any of Jehovah's Witnesses. Now that's a British law. So I have the crime number and thanks to the watchtower for actually making the mentally diseased apostate video, I'm able to use that crime number. So you said, I will explain, every video you upload will leave a signature trace, your personal IP address. Well, if you know that, why are you making these comments? Because you're going to be traced. But I'll see you in court.